Vi har nu et det er det lille problemet med kommunikation. Men her kommer han springende. Så vi så der tak fast der kommer han her. En to en to en to en to. Ja. He would give total strangers things they would never expect. He loved to give them something and look at their face and could not believe how they felt. It made them really feel good when he gave them something they could never ever get themselves. One time we were in a Cadillac dealership in Memphis during Christmas time, and he was buying a couple of Cadillacs for a couple of his relatives. So we um, were there, and Elvis looks outside the window, and there's this tall, elderly lady looking at this beautiful yellow Cadillac. And he sees her out there looking at it. And he says, Joe, come with me. We walk outside, and he goes over and talks to the lady. And she couldn't believe it. Elvis was talking to her. So um, he's telling her, you really like that car, don't you? And he says, oh, yes, I really do. I, I can never afford something like that. He said, really? He said, OK. So he goes inside the dealership. Comes five minutes, comes back out, and he hands her the keys. He says, the car is yours. So thank you. Let's go inside, fill out the papers, and take it. And she started crying. She hugged him. She couldn't believe that he, this guy just gave her a brand new Cadillac at that time, which was a lot of money. And, uh, but he loved to make people really feel good about things like that. That's what we do it all the time. We did it so many different ways over the years. You know, and read something in a paper about something happened to somebody. And he said, Joe, go take care of those people. And it was one, one time, I read the paper, and it, there was a story about this young boy in a wheelchair. And somebody stole his wheelchair off his front porch of his house. And now, how bad could somebody be to steal somebody's wheelchair? So he said, Joe, go get that kid a wheelchair right away. So we went out and bought a wheelchair. I took it to his house and gave it to the father. And I said, this is for Elvis, for your son. And they really couldn't believe it. They were so happy to see Elvis do that. That's the way he was about everything. But, but a lot of times, every Christmas, we all had a party at his house. And Grayson was decorated like it's unbelievable. You should still see it today. It's so decorated, the whole property, everything. In the house, we had a big Christmas tree. We had decorated well. We were all there with his relatives and with all the guys that worked for him. So we all changed gifts between each other, okay? So then usually, every year at Christmas, Elvis would give everybody a check, a bonus check for working. So he gave it, handed everybody a check, and not a check, an envelope, everybody an envelope. So we all opened it up and looked at it, you know, and we were a little shocked. We couldn't believe it. There was McDonald Hamburger gift certificates inside the envelope. Now that cost about five American dollars. And we just didn't know what to say. It was, what do you say about that, you know? He saw all the, sh the looks on our faces and he couldn't believe it. And he just laughed. He just laughed, I couldn't believe it. He said, okay. Then he got the real envelopes out and gave us all our envelopes. But he'd like to do those kinds of silly little jokes once in a while. But he was an amazing individual. I love him and uh, just, uh, I don't know what to tell you. I had a great life because of him, and I still, people, he still keeps me going. He's in my mind every day, and I love to meet people, and they always ask me all the questions about him, and I have no problem answering the questions, because I was there for all those years, and uh, I will always be here for him, as long as I'm alive, okay? Anyway, I'm glad all you people are here enjoying the show, and uh, we'll uh, 
I'll see you guys later. Mr. Joe Esposito. And I know that uh, you are also the one that likes to give away things and make people happy. Now, we had an opportunity, you and I, this moment. Uh, Saxtal Service, where you do, please come here. Right behind you. Okay, you too. Okay. Okay. Everybody. <laughs> there's, there's a wonderful man. He loves Elvis. He's a, a real adult lover man. He, he sings his songs. He keeps Elvis's memory alive in people's hearts. He's like a, a, a honorary ambassador for Elvis. And he will always do that all his life. And he's a great man. He's really nice. He's a wonderful individual. I know if Elvis ever met him, he would have really liked him. And for that reason, he's here, and we're going to give him a Christmas present, okay? Så kan det vara. Från Memphis var Elvis 